my rhythm right now that I didn't get the Drake Sword. I'm kind of surprised about that one though, like I'm, I'm pretty sure I hit the tail at least three times with the resin, but no. Must have missed or something. Yeah, without the Drake Sword it's gonna be a bit tough, but dying there. Pretty much ruined everything. Maybe I shouldn't even have tried to do the throwing knife stuff because I'm not even consistent at it. Like, it might save a bit of time if I do it optimally, it might save me a resin. But it really doesn't matter. So it's really dumb to go for it because it's just another point to reset that doesn't even make any sense. Just great. Am I too close? No. He did a very slow attack anyway, but he follows it up as well. That means two rolls instead of one. Now the only item in the game that actually gets equipped into your hot slots Death's Flask. I'm not sure why they really decided that it was necessary to change that in the remaster. Like in some senses it's Convenient, but I don't know. It, it really. They could go either way with that. It's not like the one is more convenient than the other. It would probably just come down to personal preference more, more so than objectively more convenient. Or more logical, I don't know. I mean, you can still do whatever you want. You can put whatever you want. And you can equip whatever you want from your quick use items. You almost built your coke trying to kill a fly. Oh no. At least I have enough stamina to not fall off the ladder, so that's good. I don't think I need to heal either, so should be good here. Very nice. Probably just heal up twice instead of just once. Don't know if I had enough time to switch to the shield and then block. Hmm. Hmm. 
Somebody. Peter Pesket is nice, especially when you're already half health, so. Just makes it more consistent to go through the lower end of Berg. If you get Peter Pesket, you land on the dog, you stun him, he's out of the way. Pretty good. Hello, Dark Lorian. Hey Tom, thanks for the good luck. Oh no, not not my health. That was really inconvenient, I mean... I missed one swing there, which... I don't know why I missed. But then he didn't die. I'm doing alright, Storkalorian. I just great man. This this aim and everything is just perfect. Are you? Oh come on, man! I just oh. Yeah, quick scope the dragon. So good. So yeah, we're losing out on the Drake Sword apparently, so that's gonna be tough on uh, Iron Golem. I'm probably just gonna switch to the Great Heavy Solero. But it's probably not gonna stagger in like one shot even without or like even with the magic ring. I guess with the ring he will, but I don't know, I don't like doing it. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Darkalorian is alright, thank you. much to do. Feels pink man. Finish with school. Let's see, what do we need? Nothing really. That's convenient. Well, Mr. Schnug is drinking soda. You gotta be sub to him as well. Maybe. What is that, Soda W or what? Some, something else? Mm -hmm. 
Loba subs, man. They're the worst. <laughs> Just kidding. So what do we do? Um, we're gonna do the same as usual. We're just not gonna level up strength though, because we don't need to. <laughs> oh no, they're everywhere. Just jealous, yeah. So we're gonna pick up those souls. See what we can do with that. Uh, I don't even know if I need to pop them as well. It's like because we're not getting strength, we can actually get more levels. Which is convenient, actually, in a way. One, 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 one. Is that Age of Empires language? Or is that something else? Eleven. Yeah, don't spill your coke. And do your th things that you need to do. Yeah, apart from not getting the Drake Sword, the run is pretty okay. Nothing majorly wrong with it. Just didn't get the Drake Sword, so we're gonna have to. Very complex DPS rotation. In the... Wow, okay. Makes sense. Another host. No. Hey, Blue East Sunday. One three shift one repeat. Well, thanks for the host motors. Hope you're streaming well. On the original OG version of this fantastic hardest game ever made kind of game. Let's see, what do we do? Is my health good enough? Uh, it's a little bit low, unfortunately. What do I do? What do I do? I feel like I need to cast fall control in the second drop as well here, just to not take damage. But I don't, I don't know if I want to even because then I'll be way too high on health, and I, I don't know. If I don't, I'm gonna be low and it's gonna be super scary. This is probably gonna be slower, but... I just kinda have to do it. Because I messed up. Well, it might also be slightly... Is 
slightly awful to get fall damage here. Maybe I'll just quit out. It's like I still have hidden body active or the fall control active, so I can't take fall damage. <laughs> Glackim is also hosing me, wow. Thanks for the host, Glackim. You're welcome. How was your Raymond too? And good luck on work. I'm just wasting time here. This is supposed to be a speed run. But thanks for the host. I uh, I just set up my house badly for my red tier sun ring range. Like I want to be lower than twenty percent health, huh, but I was too high on health and the poison. I just drained your health so slowly, so you you kind of want to have a good setup for that, otherwise you're wasting time. It's orangey manipulation. It's not too bad of a fight, considering. Definitely gonna lose time, but... Not surprising. Excuse me? That's not too bad. You're a monster. Pretty intelligent monster, then. Caught a fly, ripped its wings off, and let it go. <laughs> okay. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna. We're gonna tune the Great Heavy Soul Arrow, and we're gonna have to let the Snackman break the wall. And use the Great Heavy Soul Arrow for Iron Golem. I'm probably gonna have to use the, the Medic Ring as well. On that fight. Let's see, put it like that. And I'm also used to picking up like all of the souls in Sense Fortress. Or at least three of them. So that I can pop them for later and I'll have a bit more souls. A bit higher level. Mostly. A walk. Let's see how we do against this RNG. The snack has like two attacks that are. Yep, that's one of them. There's only two attacks that can actually break the wall, and that he has to do them. Uh, that's like no damage. Just gonna quit out. It is extremely dangerous. So we must deal with it. Oh, 
I'm a monster, a monster is annoyed by fly. Um How do we set up Archisar here? Probably with the dude with the crossbow on top of Sense Fortress, but do we unequip the armor? Do we take a counter hit? Uh, do we t do we do both? Next time, set it on fire. I would say counter hit, but do I take the armor off? That's it's actually probably a no. I should have done this soul. I don't know if I'm gonna get wrecked by a boulder now and fire, but I guess I didn't. Forgot to pick up the soul. Throw it in the toilet and piss in it. Just like those fake flies. A real fake fly. Feels amazing, man. Oh, calculate it. So close, man. Could you just get out of my way because I'm on a mission? for speed. It's supposed to be a speed run, you know? I don't know if I heard a story about cockroach, maybe. It's actually kind of comfy uh, doing a fight like this. Uh, I'm just gonna be extra comfy, I guess. I'm not gonna die to that boulder of fire and doom. And I'll land a yump. I did take a while to skip the cutscenes though, so that was not very optimal, but was a decent sense fortress considering I had no Drake sword. Um, one problem could be now that I have less health because I don't have the fat ring, so Anna Londo might be a little bit scary. Well, we should have more level ups for later, but no safe threats for. stuff. If we're running out of spells, we don't have the rakes or to back up. Come on, see. Did I just fart? <laughs> Maybe. Hi, my show. I already said hi, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah, we have less health here, uh, no Drake's with backup threats, but we should have more. more ints because we have less of the other stuff. Which is strength for the Drake Sword, because we don't have the Drake Sword. Need to practice and stream your presentation. I would have to agree with that.
Hi. Hi, Severus. I thought for a second you were Monsure because same color. Oh, that's unfortunate. At least we didn't die, so that's good. So the lack of health didn't kill us here. We can also not use the Drake Sword against those archers, unfortunately. That's a little bit bad, but he should be falling off now here. No problems. It was decent RNG for not being able to use the Drake Sword. I'm not sure how much this soul is worth. I would say it's 8,000, but... No, it could be more. If it's 10,000 or more, I wouldn't... I wouldn't need to save my souls, because I want to have 10,000 plus the 50,000 that the boss gives me after I kill the boss, so... But if this is over 10,000, then I would probably like to have more attunement or intelligence. But... I have no idea. So I need to not lose my blood stain, because if I lose my blood stain, die twice to NS without collecting it. That's unfortunately I hit the, I hit the wrong boss. This might kill him. How can you dodge like that? I mean, come on. Well, should have stayed locked on. I didn't know my lock on was gonna transfer between the cutscenes so smoothly. Bye, Glackham. Good luck on work. Work hard so you can. Subscribe for free with Twitch Prime, which you already have. <laughs> okay, that was easy. You Twitch Prime Spike, okay. That's good. So I didn't look how much souls I got there, but I believe it was uh, 8,000. Which I already said that it was gonna be 8,000, but I... I don't know. Was it? I mean, I got 20,000. Oh, come on, man. What? But, but like, why, game? Didn't get the Lord Vessel, even. Did you guys buy, find anything interesting this summer so? Well, I bought absolutely nothing because I have no money. Heading up. Well, I think Age of Empires 2 HD is on sale. Which is pretty cool.
Uh, what am I doing? Okay, that's definitely not optimal. Yeah, I mean, I have enough. I have I have enough games as it, as it is. So really, like, buying games would be not the smartest thing to do. I guess the last thing I bought was like Dark Souls Remastered just because it's Dark Souls and before that I think it was either some game to co-op or it was like the Age of Empires 2 expansions because they seem pretty cool. And I guess maybe some free games that I got for free from like websites or from Steam itself or from good old games. Just free games every now and then. For Honor, that was free. But I haven't played it, so like doesn't matter. know what to do for like five euros five euros is fine I also got some extra s games on Steam because the, the good old game connect or so but that doesn't really count Okay, no fall damage at least. I didn't mean to drop there, but I took no fall damage, which was intended. But <laughs> Assassin's Creed Origins. Hmm. I actually have Assassin's Creed Black Flag, and I have Assassin's Creed. What is it? Revelations? Unity. Assassin's Creed Unity. But yeah, I'm not, not really playing that. Yeah, you play everything Assassin's Creed is on you play, even if you buy it on Steam. Can I YOLO cast? I mean, not really. Origin is dog shit. Nah, I don't know. I have very few reasons to buy new games, usually. Do I have another soul? No. Let's just pop that. Yay, we didn't die. That was actually a good fight. You have to check all the pages. I don't like reading.
Uh, we're just gonna go like that. It's because I'm a speedrunner, I don't like reading. Well, I don't think so. I think I'm mostly a speedrunner for um, because of other Twitch streamers. And... Because I didn't mind spending more time in the same game. So then I just at some point started streaming and started improving my time. But it's still not very good though, but that's not the point. The point is that you have splits that you sometimes beat. Maybe. Fame, money, and e-girls, if only. I mostly get the get the fame, though. And I can say yes to dusks every now and then. So that's good. <laughs> e girls. You'll post how to see girl you can find. I won't ban you, because I believe that's probably just going to be a grill. I couldn't see what it was. But we're gonna be doing Duke Skip very soon. One of the more iconic Dark Souls beat tag. food and you're still hungry. Hmm. Blame someone. That's a nice grill. We could actually pop the Soul of the Moon, my butterfly. So why not? Give me 1,200 souls. 
I'm gonna play it safe and actually pull the elevator down. Just in case we die now, it's gonna be much better when I die to run back there. How can this dumbass even dodge my shots, man? Now, the good thing is here that even though I wasted a spell, I actually had tuned the Great Soul Arrow already. Normally, I would have the the Drake Sword as a, kind of like a backup, but. We're gonna have to rely on Great Soul Arrow, but hopefully we're not gonna get pushed into some seed spikes and that was unfortunate. Oh, first try every try. All the times I tried it today I got it first try. All the one times out of the one. Well, it's kind of dumb though, like you can you can just easily miss certain enemies or bosses when they just do some kind of an animation and then the spell misses. It's not like they even tried to dodge or did anything extreme, it's just they, well, they did some, some animation and then the spell just completely misses because of the lock on point seems to not like it. So this might be a slightly more scary seat. Because we're gonna be low on spells, which means using lower damage spells, which means the fight lasts longer, which means potentially more RNG. Well, maybe we can still kill Seed before anything happens, but we'll see. Yay, nice. Having or Chisar. I'll just use the Great Soul Arrow to break the crystal. I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna miss that one, so I'm not gonna embarrass myself. And then I might just spam Great Soul Arrow on Seed as well, just to see when he's gonna be vulnerable. Those spikes are pretty scary. That went fine, fortunately. I just know that he, he has shoved me into the spikes at some point and then I died and it was not a very good thing to happen. So whenever stuff is slightly bad there, I, I always remember that something like that might just happen. But it didn't this time, so that's good. Yeah, just got back. Welcome back, Mr. Schnuck.
<laughs> fixing your graduation hat. You really have that thing? Yep. There was that other thing that... Some place people could just wear whatever they want to their graduation. So they were all memeing hard. That's pretty good. I don't know if that was Japan or. I mean, come on. I almost dodged that as well. Every graduate buys them. Nice, nice business. I should just buy a hat then. People think that I graduated as well. Feels good, man. Monsieur. Is that one you have? Alright, thanks. <laughs> Make you stare. Comfy tag. Hey, the not X. I'm trying to run, I'm not trying to backstep game plays. Look at the speed, I'm actually running up the stairs there. I'm scared. Guys, it's so easy to PB. You just need to not play the game, then get like the best runs. So good. Uh, what am I gonna buy then? I believe it was one of these, maybe a couple of safeties. Dark Antelorian. <laughs> graduate together. Should I come tomorrow? Like, just send me the address and then. <laughs> just kidding. I think it was some. Some bunch of attacks that Lord Glorian wrote. Obviously we missed, that, that makes sense. The buff is nice. Nice not X, congrats on last year. You can become a full-time memer, just like me. <laughs> Graduated seven years ago. Time flies if you're having fun. Mool cat. Uh, I need to tune or I need to equip that stupid 
Lloyd's Talisman, so I can actually just do stuff. You got no time to do stuff at all. Feels bad, man. Nice cats. Oh, I rolled like super early, but it's still dodge death. July full of night shifts. Feels bad, man. But night shifts means extra pay. I mean, probably, maybe, usually. might be interested all right thanks for considering me appreciate it <laughs> don't hit me very good Look at that optimal threat. I'm actually scared that I'm gonna die to fall damage now, but we're not gonna peach out. We're gonna actually take this. Easy. With the roar feels big man. Not nice. I should have realized that was not gonna kill him. Slowly risk. Um, I think he can do the spell before 50%, yes. It's not like the trigger is exactly at 50%. Maybe more like 40 or so, but I don't know. It's like, actually... Arturia's buffs very early too, like a just one soul spirit and like a bit over 25% he could already buff. Not like at 50% only, but yeah, I think Manus is a bit closer to 50%. That is just brilliant. Blocking the dog, getting guard broken, rolling out of it, and getting a counter hit on the bite. That is beautiful. 
I already didn't like the fact that it guard broke me, but that's fine. No problem. The mage life. Getting guard broken by a fly. Seems good. Madness has multiple triggers. I think there's just one. He either does the black magics or he doesn't do them. Then again, what do I know about the game? Pre pretty much nothing. Filthy Mage speedrun. Oh, crap is really filthy, so I don't. I've never seen you have problems with Crapple Mage. So, what's with <laughs> Filthy Mage? That's not what I copied. Copy this. Paste that. Well, one more DLC boss and then we're actually off to uh, clean up time. That's looking pretty good so far. I'm just gonna cast once there. I could probably cast twice, but it's a little bit more risky then. Very good. Z game. Now we're just in time to go ahead and fail the lower net burg skip and stuff like that. But I actually practiced that like way long ago. I think 16 is all I need. I actually don't know how much in uh, bit. I'm not sure how much bit I was gonna get. I just need to be precise about the lower end of Berg skip and then we should be fine. Splits look good. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. See, so yeah, it's easy. I just need to not die to this boss. GG. Like it's just... The lower end of Berg skip is just about lining it up, really. Being high enough on the stairs, jumping uh, in the right direction there. At the right spot and we should be okay then.
No crash. Feels amazing, man. I was trying to run in a circle, but then I... I stopped sprinting for a bit, and then I sprint for a bit, but... Um, I gotta jump instead, but that's not really a problem. It's a few seconds lost, but that's really nothing. So now I'm actually getting scared for losing the run in a stupid way, because the, the run has been pretty decent so far. Like, ob obviously, things could have been better. But. It's pretty heat. Probably gonna play this a bit safe as well. Don't stress about it, yeah. I mean, I have over five minutes before the run is actually rip, so... It's gonna be quite tough to do, actually. <laughs> Hey, MP. You were lurking? Enjoy lurking. Thanks for the good luck. Yeah, I'll just play it safe. Uh, I don't know how safe that was, though. But if I calculated that hitbox correctly, it didn't hit me. Which it didn't. Lost a lot of, a bunch of opportunities to post cute anime waifus. It's like I, I was trying to play Stradium and save. Because you could actually go in front of him and just cast. But because I don't have 45 ducks and because I might have just missed or miscalculated my intelligence levels and I might have not one shot at the boss with that and then I would have actually gotten killed. Uh, sometimes you also cannot run behind him because it just blocks you with his tail or his foot and then it's like oh. I, I wish I would have played a little bit safer and lost like four seconds instead of doing this. <laughs> so that's okay. Probably just gonna heal up. Play it safe, not fast, play it safe. I don't want to die to bone wheels. It's like my health is already super low, so I don't want to be even lower. I've not a lot of hit points, but I do want to have full hit points before attempting that. Because I don't really want to throw this one away. I mean, 
losing a couple of seconds on the later splits is probably better than losing a minute. Then again, like all those seconds are gonna add up. So we're about five minutes ahead only anymore. Already lost 15. What's next? Uh, I don't know. I wasn't expecting to PvP today because I haven't, I haven't actually touched this game in the past couple of days, so I didn't think about it. Really? I wow, that sucked. I mean, FTL is always an option. It's a girl, friend of Virgil. Randomizer is always an option. You mean a link to the past randomizer? I guess sure, but that's quite long ago that I did that. Old school strats. Didn't even use Dark Beat there. Well, that was nice. He didn't scream, so that was perfect. And we lost another 8 seconds because I didn't get the happy jump. That is no good. That's fine. I'm probably not going to get Archisar here as well. What a noob. Uh, Archisar backup threat is probably still going to be a blocked counter hit of the magic if he does the magic. I'm also not sure how my intelligence levels are, so I'm probably just going to play it safe. Use Soul Spears. It's fine, it's fine. I mean, it's going to be more difficult using the Soul Spears, uh, apart from just Dark Beating twice. Forty-eight ends. I don't know. Doesn't really save me much. Just be nicer, okay? Thanks. No problem, then. Mm. 
What? Hmm. Might be a good thing that I actually did the soul spears there, but... Losing more time yet again. I'm glad you got to listen to the Four Kings soundtrack a bit longer, EMP. Guardian Soul. The rest should be pretty easy. Although, I don't know. They don't help easy, really. Still, memes can happen. Bed of Chaos can happen. I don't think I will take... Um I don't think I'll take a button fire before Bed of Chaos, but we'll see. Maybe I'll actually get enough vitality. Maybe that's a smart play. Because I have a ton of souls. I should probably just go for a 23 bit. If I can get there. I mean, 22 is fine too. And then just take a sprinting counter hit. That's probably better. Well, I don't really need the souls at this point, Dark Alorian. I don't really need more int or bit. But it would be safer to get more health. Just for a bit of chaos, I would say. It's a toy. Should have equipped this stupid ring. That's fine. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that after after seed, I don't need to pop any more souls, or even after butterfly, I don't need to pop those souls. But there's just downtime on elevators and stuff like that when you could just use them without losing any time. But I probably used some where I actually lost a bit of time, but that's fine. It's okay. 23 bits because why not I think after this boss I'm just gonna equip the ring and that's gonna ensure me that I will get RTSR no matter whatever fall damage I get because sometimes I've gotten not enough fall damage before fire sage and it's confusing So I'll just equip that and if we get below 40% health with half health, which equates to less than 20% health with full health, then it's a lot easier to set it up like that. What's your score prediction? Mm, I would say 123. 30?
Without the ring I would have had enough health as well, but... Yeah, this is just more consistent. <laughs> One twenty three thirty would be eighty thirty. That's a quite a high score. I should have equipped the stupid magic ring. Well, hey, it doesn't matter. We're actually saving out on a dark beat by doing that. Strats. Maybe. <laughs> oh, really? That was a time save. Okay, maybe we're actually going to be faster than the AT30 guess. I didn't consider that was a time save still. Let's see, we're gonna have four dark beats for. Actually, that didn't save me a casting at all, because with the ring I had more castings, but without the other ring I was doing less damage. So instead of using two spells, I had to use three spells, but because of the ring I actually counted as two, but then. Like. Completely useless. Because I could have just done it with two because of stuff. Yay. So now we can actually unequip the crown and with this amount of health and if we're actually at full health and bed of chaos, we're not gonna be one shot of by Chaos Firestorm, which is fantastic. It's probably much better than actually getting the safety one car. And it's probably a little bit safer as well. Faster, safer. I mean, what are the odds that I'm actually gonna die? You know? It's not even that high, so... It's fine. You're done with powerpoints. Very nice. I'm, I'm sad I got stuck in the branch there. I, I sometimes see people get stuck on a branch, but I, I like to believe that I'm not one of those people, but I just, just disappointed myself because I wasn't paying attention. I also told myself to go for the left here. I mean, for the right. But I didn't do it correctly, and because I didn't do it correctly, lost a bit of time here by just running, running on this thing. That's fine, that's fine. Are you... No... No, 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 no... It's gotta be a joke. I was so sure that was gonna hit. Yeah, 
At least I bought extra fire bombs, which I didn't even use, but at least I got like the backup strat. Oh, I was almost too early with the bone out. Alright, so. That went fine. <laughs> it was only slightly stressful. Slightly, maybe. Are we going to get Mon percent or are we going to do non arches or Priscilla? Because I'm actually considering not doing it, but I, I don't know. I'm, I'm probably still going to do it. No arches are? Okay. No arches are. I don't like. Uh, I don't even have arches are anyway, so it's fine. I don't like to peach out on like getting a moan percent, but because I kinda know that there is a consistent way to not get it. But I don't trust the remaster in that sense. On the original game I would have done RTSR every time, but on the remaster I just don't trust it. Because I've gotten moan percent and I didn't I didn't think I was doing anything weird, but I still got it. <laughs> Full retards, or something like that. Also, taking a bonfire here is a little bit slow, but if we die to the boss now, it's actually convenient to have it. But we're probably not gonna die anyway. But it's not that much of a time loss at all. Somehow I'm not worrying. Maximum damage. Why am I not doing maximum? Oh, because I'm not using RTSR. Why am I? I'm silly. I'm like, what? Why is my damage so low? <laughs> when I don't have RTSR active. So you can actually one-shot him with RTSR without the magic ring or without the crown. Just leave one of them, and it's fine. So in this run I actually didn't forget to split on any of the splits, which is pretty good. It, it really doesn't matter, but it's pretty good. It's a little bit risky to go there without uh, using hit body, but that's fine. Um, probably also gonna have to go to the lower part of the bridge because of the fact that I don't have RTSR. It's kind of dumb, but whatever. Let's just hope we're not gonna fall down silly. And then we should be fine. Just be nice RNG skip. Ugh, I hate it. I hate falling off the ledge because I don't really know what you can do to prevent that. Also a little bit unnecessary because I don't have RTSR anyway, so those arrows aren't gonna kill me. I also don't know if hidden body is necessary there at all. I really don't. Pretty 
Nuggets. Should probably take off these clothes. So I'm pretty sure I don't want those on. Before the house set up, the archers are set up there. So close to sub 120 already. Not like that's a fantastic time, but I'm pretty okay with that. Look at that calculated setup right there. It's so good. Aim for a sub one, yeah. Maybe if I do any percent. No, not this attack. That's scary. Somebody fell off the bridge and died. That's fine. One more parry that can kill it. Oh, felt like so early of a parry. But it worked. So GG. Easy game. That's those little bosses. I also save time here because I actually got a fast Archisar set up. Where in the splits I probably goofed around a little bit. So that's a pretty good run. Bit of time loss too bad, hell set up for our GSR for Quellock. Bit of memes at ONS could have been a little bit faster there. After the DLC I really played it safe, I could have... Could have been faster on those splits, but that's fine. It's pretty good. So 121 44 in game time. I have to create a 121 46, which doesn't matter. But yeah, that's uh, that's Dark Souls, I guess. Fastest I've ever beaten the remaster, not even fast as I've beaten the remaster all bosses because. I actually haven't done any any percent in this game. So Yay. Time for actual fun games now. Just kidding, we're gonna play FTL. <laughs>